I showed you what we got on camera. What were you trying to do in that moment before you got sprayed? Pull the guy away. I mean, I've seen, I've seen footage from Hong Kong of like how you have to get people away from the cops because once they get them, they arrest them, they brutalize them, they beat them. They look like I saw the guy with the baton and the guy that had the tear gas launcher, I guess. And it's like, okay, so you're aiming that at people. Like you're muzzle sweeping people in the crowd with this. This is a bounce off the ground scenario. Not even a shoot into the air scenario because it can come down. Like basic gun safety it still applies to everything from paintball guns to you know tear, tear gas launchers. So that wasn't happening. Saw the guy with the saw the guy with the baton. Saw the guy they were trying to drag down, and I was like, nope, nope, shit, no. So yeah. Um, you ran up there, and then what happened? So I started grabbing the guy and dragging him up, and trying to pull him up the top because it's hard to get up from down. And something hit me in the ass. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry for the <laughs> unprintable language, but uh, yeah, I'm gonna have a nasty bruise. Uh, it hurts. Yeah, you didn't know. You asked me uh, what yeah. happened Did, when you see how like how much it shot you backwards, how strong that spray was. What were your thoughts? Like, like when you see what happened, plus you felt it. Too. Well, no wonder my blood hurts. <laughs> that's, that's pretty much what I was thinking. I was like, I think I've got like three seconds. I either get this guy up or they drag him down. And if he goes down, I'm probably gonna go down too. And if I go down there too, they're gonna hit me. So.